Indian traditional outfit, that's why I got it. So I think the wedding starts every night, like at night, so that's why it's already seven and yeah, the bus is extra. So nice. So let me keep on showing you. Hey guys welcome back to our channel in case you're new please subscribe so guys this is the main reason as to why i'm in india i'm going to attend this indian wedding traditional wedding so guys this wedding lasts for about a week they have different functions that they do every each day so today they're going to do the actual wedding and then after a day the today is um yeah after a day so tomorrow they'll rest then the next day it will be the reception yeah so get ready with me as i'm i get ready to go and attend this wedding for the first time hopefully i'll find more black people there not only me because these indian people are great people <laughs> now i'll tell you guys my experience at the airport but let's first enjoy this time of the wedding see you once i'm ready so this is the type of hair i came with braids but in the cornrows form and then something behind like um bututu. it's called bututu or three three that's what i have so let me get ready i'm going to be wearing my traditional outfit and then showing you guys so guys i'm ready this is my outfit as i did not show you when i was coming out but this is it this is how it looks like this is basically from western part of uganda this is how we dress up so i thought it would be blending with the indian traditional outfit that's why i got it so i think the wedding starts every night like at night so that's why it's already seven and yeah the bus is coming to pick us up so see you guys once the bus is here but i'm going to be showing you the busy road here see you so guys we are still waiting for the bus as you can see it's loud noisy but this is the hotel that we are staying at there is also another wedding that is taking place here it's hot that's why i'm <laughs> sweating yeah it's already seven but too hot and the bus has delayed by 20 minutes i thought this is an african thing of not keeping time but i think it's worldwide it's worldwide so stop blaming africans for not keeping time and another thing that i noticed here in india like there is uh, the lord everywhere like the gods that they do believe in everywhere like everyone has a literally god in their cars in their house in their businesses everywhere which is beautiful so guys let me keep waiting if there's anything i'll show you As you can see this cow right here it's uh, another symbol of the gods i think they do worship i don't think i think that's the right thing there's a car coming so let me move this way yeah so i think this is one of the cars that are going to take us to the wedding they say they are buses so let me pass they don't knock me we are still waiting but i wanted to show you guys the car yeah that is it let me keep walking i mean waiting from here Talas. So 
So guys, after the bus set, it was almost coming to eight when we left our hotel to go at the temple where the wedding will be taking place. So this is the beautiful view from my window where I'm sitting. And there are many buses. I think everyone is going back home at this time. So every time people are hooting like crazy. Don't know it's an Indian thing because I used to see this in the movie. Kampala is busy and they do hoot but not this much. I think it so guys we are here. We have just arrived for I don't know how long we have rode in the bus, but the bus is leaving as you can see. And this is the the reception. This is how it looks like. This is where we're going to have the wedding from. And these are the people who are going to get married, the family. So, I'll be showing you what I can show you and what I can't show you. Let me enjoy it on your behalf. So, see you guys inside. Let me take some pictures out here, then we shall meet. So, guys, that is the entrance look how this place looks beautiful this is beautiful 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 look at the reception Ooh, can't wait to take a picture here and i post on instagram guys see you see you. i'm going to take when i get closer there let me see guys this is the reception Beautiful, these are natural flowers. Ooh. Okay, so right now I'm entering. I hope my mic is warm. Yeah, it's still on. There's thunderstorm, it's as if it's gonna rain, but it's just a walkway. You guys can see it's just a walkway to the reception, and then there is a don't know how it's called like a gourd or something. And this is the reception. Let me enter in our video later. But it's beautiful. And by the way, are we going to sit? Oh, this is what we are drinking. I think they are giving us. That's juice. Thank you. So, guys, this is the juice that they are giving us. What? Okay, give one. Can you make for me? Without spice, without pepper? I don't want spice, but I'll spice. I'll tell something else. <laughs> Thank you. So guys, I'm going to Let's 
Chapati. Chapati. I think I have to wait here. Where is the sauce? I don't know. No, I don't want things that have. Uh, I don't want things that have uh, spicy. Yeah. Okay. Something maybe. So guys, after eating, we went outside. As you can see, that fountain. So there are two buildings. There is one, one on the left and another one on the right. So one is for the wedding itself and the other one is all the dining area where we are eating from. There is everything, food, meat, non-veggie, veggie. So anything, what I like about India, I think they always prioritize and make a room for people who don't eat meat. So they always have special food for them. Yeah. 